Hey there, internet. So I just drove from San Francisco to LA. So I'm down here to shoot a VR pilot for a company. I can't say what company, but I'll just say they're a digital news agency. I'm also staying with my buddy Kevin, who works at Kodak. Um, I'm parked right down the street from his place. I'm gonna go surprise him. So here we are at Disney, or near Disney. About Downtown to check, Disney. Downtown Disney. I'm gonna check out the Star Wars VR experience. Even if you're not a Star Wars fan, I'm sure it's a lot of fun. So I'm here for the experience, right? This is actually my first time at Disney too. So ah, cool. that, was, that was a big factor for me yeah. for wanting to do this. But it's about 10.45 at night we're going out to do this. So it gives you an idea of how committed we are. All right, so we made it to the void. We're inside. We're inside. We got tickets at 10.45, so we're like 30 minutes early. You can see, pretty awesome. They got like videos going in the back. Also sell merchandise. What type of merchandise you got here? The jacket looks pretty swanky. How much? Pricey, but it looks nice. I mean, depending how good the experience is. Have you tried it? What would you say? Would you give it like two thumbs up? Yes. So you saw the inside of the void. Now here's the outside. Let's see. Pretty awesome. It says Void, Step Beyond Reality. This is a hyper-reality experience. Star Wars VR, you walk around, you work with a friend to destroy Taxi. the Emperor. It'll be interesting, I'm we'll ready. see what it is. Save the universe. I'm certainly curious, but I've never tried a Void experience. I didn't get to try the Ghostbusters. It'll be my first time so too. I just had to try it. Yeah, let's And we do decided it. to do it together. We'll let you know how it feels. Yeah, you know. So we just got out of the Void Star Wars experience. What do you think about it? I really liked it. I really mm -hmm. liked it. It was worth it. It was pretty short experience. It was short. It I would needed say. to be longer. How long would you think it was? Uh, it felt like 15 minutes. Yeah, it felt like 15 minutes, but it felt like 30 minutes of getting there, waiting, yeah. having to go through it. Yeah. It's cool they have some original footage with uh, Diego Luna and some of the other Star Wars characters. Um, you at one point get to shoot at Darth Vader. Um, yeah, that's, that's probably the cool. funnest part, and you get to feel heat. Yeah. Like they had some other sensor, uh, you know, stimulation, which mm -hmm. was really cool. You could smell different things in the environment. It was pretty neat overall. Um, honestly, though, I was kind of expecting a little bit more out of the experience. Yeah, it could have been how longer. Hyped it was more, more experience. It wasn't. It was too short. Like um, the actual gameplay was really short versus all the everything else the setup. The setup is cool though because it helps you immerse yourself a bit, so it's cool. But the actual action part needs to be a lot longer. So basically when you go into the experience, you are four different stormtroopers. You pick out your color and everything, and you can see each other and you see your hands. Yeah, you can see your hands without having any gloves or, or, or anything, so that's really cool. That was very impressive. We were able to give each other high fives and all that. And then we got our guns. Yeah. And we start shooting our laser guns at other stormtroopers, at aliens, at Darth Vader. Spoiler. I'm sure they're gonna to continue to do it. The Void said that they're gonna be around indefinitely there. Yeah, so at this downtown Disney location. Expect to see more Disney Void partnerships, I'm guessing, yep. in the foreseeable future. Very cool. Anyway, if you like this video, thank you guys so much for watching. Please and subscribe. We'll see you soon. We'll see you in the next Hit video. Hit that like button, comment, tell us if you're gonna do it or not. Yeah. And if you think it's cool, two thumbs up.